residential facilities we've got um, consist of 76 student bedrooms, 24 are en suite and the rest are standard shared accommodation where they share bathrooms. Other facilities that we have are the Walford Club. All the students become members of the Walford Club and in the evening we do activities for the students. The residences are particularly useful for people who wouldn't be able to come to Walford because the travelling distance is too far and particularly agriculture students where they have to get up early for duties and sometimes work later in the evenings. A lot of the resident students value being resident because they have support in the evenings to complete assignments. Life at Walford is pretty good to be honest with you. It's like, you know, home away from home, there's always activities going on. Well, everyone just feels like an extended family really. I just find that I don't have to worry about my assignments as much because then I know that I'm here the library's up just down there. I, don't, I haven't got any distractions. I'd have a home, so I can just focus completely on my assignments. When I first came here, I was very shy, and the wardens just spoke to some of the peer mentors that lived in them, like, to try and socialise with them, make friends with them, maybe. And since then, I have made a lot of friends. So, yeah, it's helped me come out of my shell. Each night, there's a drop in session where the warden's in the office from 5 30 till 6 30, and students can just drop in for a chat or if they want, you know, to book a time where they want to speak to somebody more privately, they can do that. There are two wardens on duty Monday to Thursday and then one warden at a weekend because there are fewer students about at weekends. And our job is to ensure everybody's safety. So we check around the site and we check in the blocks that people are happy, that they're contented. We do things such as quizzes, Temping bowling, ice skating, karaoke, shopping trips at least twice a week so they can top up on their snacks. Being a warden at the college, um, generally a warden will work two evenings a week and then we work one weekend in five. So during that time we, we do a range of activities. We're able to offer a range of sport and recreational activities for the students and also some educational kind of workshops. Um, and support session assignment workshops for, for students during that time and also we support students to simply relax and enjoy the common areas. I live at Wilford because it would be hard for me to get up here to do the course that I want. It's good, yeah, all the, um, you make more friends coming here. And down in the club they do loads of different activities with you and they make it feel like you're at home all the time so you don't really get home sick. So. Yeah, you do duties, well, on the weekends so you live in here, and then if you don't live in, then they've got provided rooms for you. So it's easier for people to do it. Definitely live in. Yeah, it's good living in, so I would advise it to anyone.